And not too long after that, we got the call to go to Intercontinental Airport again. Uh, at that time, we really weren't sure why. Sky Eye was asked by MD Anderson Hospital to make a run to Intercontinental Airport for something we thought we'd never have experienced, and that was a life-saving mission to go and get this bone marrow. As I understand it, the shelf life of bone marrow is about 24 hours to be effective in a transplant situation. And this particular shipment had been sitting out at the airport for about 22 hours at that point. We bring you a lot of pictures, we bring you a lot of stories. We have a chance to help save someone's life. Once you let the tower know, they had given us uh, life flight status. They called us lifeguard 13. And uh, in fact, vectored me right in because the weather is very low. It was very marginally legal to fly. So we had to really watch the weather. And I'd say probably about 15 minutes after we landed, give or take a few minutes, a police van, a police car uh, pulled up with a couple of folks in it and out ran this person with a cooler. Very simple looking cooler. Uh, in my hand here is a, is a cooler. It doesn't look like much, but what I'm holding here is potential for a life-saving operation uh, that uh, will start almost immediately upon our touchdown at, uh, at Home Hospital. This is the uh, bone marrow in question. We were having difficulty really trying to figure out exactly where we were supposed to land. Uh, we ended up circling it once to find it. We're going to go to the front here, right at the front of the building at uh, Memorial Hermann Hospital. We're right now waving to Sky Eye telling them where to land. Once we found it, they had secured it off. We set it down in there and they grabbed it right away. And a lot of times you can show where people are in a bad situation or need help. But this is the first time we actually got to be involved in helping something get better rather than just demonstrating it for someone else. Very gratified that we had a small part in being able to do that. Uh, about a day or so afterwards, we'd heard that the transplant had gone well, and as of this moment, uh, we haven't had any additional updates.